You guys, I literally just did my makeup. This is the best I think that my makeup has looked. Oh my god, I gotta take my twist out. But I'm, I need to iron my jacket. I'm gonna wear this army fatigue. So last night, I, um, uh, last night I used some, um, Alicay Naturals to, um, I had to put a ring on. Let me go get it, because this is the Shea Yogurt Moisturizer by Alake Naturals. It's a moisturizer, but it works as a styler as well. I didn't really care about definition, um, even though you can use this as a styler as well. But I just wanted more stretch. I want a chunky, stretched, loose type of wave look today. But anyway, how you guys been doing? I feel like, well, first of all, I just want to say that I feel crazy right now talking to you guys. <laughs> but I missed you guys, and um, we haven't vlogged in a while, which I feel like we say that every time I put up a vlog. But we really have been busy. It's hard to keep up with the vlogs, especially because y'all know I don't play with my quality and content. Like, I want it to be good stuff. And I spend a lot of time filming and editing, so it just wasn't possible. And I will never just throw up anything, so sorry, guys. Um, um, <laughs> it still looks the same as my makeup normally looks. But it's a little bit better. And I did use different products. The lip. Girl. Oh my god. I have to show you this lip um, kit that Smashbox sent me. I promise you that this. Oh. This lipstick is so bomb. I have to show it to you. I will not have to use any other brand ever. Because this lip, not even just because they sent it to me, I will buy it. Because, yeah, the, um, the feeling, the formula, this has to be the best formula ever in the whole world. It is like a gel formula, but it's still, I don't know, it's just, um, I'm about to go get it so y'all can see it. And this is the kit they sent me. But yeah, okay, so today I have on this one, of course, because I put it in the room. I didn't even have to use a lip liner because it's that bomb. So this is the one I used, and I think I used this one as kind of like on the outside so it would have a, like a lip liner look, but you don't need lip liner. The formula is so good. But Smashbox, thanks for sending this because I love it. Today we are go it's all about the girls today because um so yeah, the girls have been on the phone too much. So I'm trying to get them outside and do some fun stuff. Like stuff that I remember doing when I was little. So we're gonna play hopscotch today. We're gonna blow some bubbles and let them just have some I don't know, like exercise, like let them flip in the grass and, you know, fun kid stuff. <laughs> because, you know, nowadays with the technology and all that stuff, like we tend to get lazy. And I'm not even talking about just them, I'm talking about me too, girl. Because, like when I'm working, which I work 24-7, I'm always working or thinking about something, um... So, kids get on my nerves. Kids are annoying. I don't care. I love Taylor Sky so much, but they are annoying sometimes. So, you know, just to get them out of my hair sometimes, I don't even care if they're playing video games or um, on their phones and stuff. Like, I'm just being honest. Like, parents have those moments, okay? So, I even find myself allowing them to be on their electronics too much so i talked to Devin, and i was like we need to get them outside um and just let them be kids and us actually go out too because sometimes we do let them play by themselves outside um especially like because i can see them 
from the living room or the balcony so um but yeah but no today we are going out i'm gonna have some fun Devin too and i'll try to get Devin on the vlog this evening like I, all of us except me i always want to vlog but i feel like y'all don't want to just see me so that's another reason why sometimes we just don't vlog because nobody be wanting to vlog like taylor sky getting their moods where they just don't want to be on camera and i definitely will never force them to do that um and devin never wants to get on there but he loves you guys i'm about to go fluff my hair out a little bit and i'll be back do you know people have for pixel films yes oh this is um robin chanel if you guys don't know her um definitely follow her on snapchat um and youtube robin chanel she's a makeup artist but she also does vlogs now and she's amazing she just texted me she put hey yolanda it's robin do you have a coupon code for pixel films of course darling i'm about to tell her she's on the vlog you're in my vlog. You're on my. I should put you're on my vlog. You're in my vlog now. I'm filming while texting you. Oh, I feel so much better. Okay, I have declared myself as the puff queen. Like this is just my thing. I actually had to use a smaller um, elastic today because my puff is getting bigger. Like usually. I'll use the, you know, like in my tutorial, I'll use that bigger one so it looks bigger. But now I actually have to use a smaller one to actually make it smaller because it's getting ridiculous. But anyway, where was I? Okay, so. Okay, I'm about <laughs> to show you how I make this detox drink that I have been drinking. I've been showing it on Snapchat, but everyone had questions. So here you go. Little guy I got from Marshalls. I get all my little kitchen gadgets from Marshalls and Home Goods because they're just the cutest. So this is what we're going to be using to um, squeeze our lemon, which I have a half a lemon. So this container is also from Home, no, from Marshalls. And it's by, the brand is called Joey. It's so cool because you can just put the um, leftover lemon in there. All right, next we're going to add add our apple cider vinegar next we're going to add some agave nectar oh no 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 let's go ahead and put the spices in all right so the first spice is cinnamon i know it sounds weird but we're gonna add cinnamon i got this from marshall's too i'll get everything from marshall's so i just have this little wooden spoon in here so i'm just gonna put just a little, I don't know, maybe like a tablespoon. And then also some cayenne pepper, y'all. This is, I think cayenne pepper is the ingredient that really helps your metabolism because it's spicy, it makes you sweat, you know what I mean? So I really think it helps with my metabolism, but I'll have to research it because I really don't know. <laughs> so we're going to add a tablespoon or teaspoon. Oh, I don't know, you guys. Sorry. All right. You have to, I'll put the, the, I don't know. I'll put the recipe. <laughs> um, what's next? Oh, then we're going to add, so we have our, we have our lemon juice. We have our, um, apple cider vinegar. Next, we're going to go ahead and pour some water in there. Agave nectar. You do not have to use agave nectar. Because let me tell y'all something. When I stopped using sugar, I went and you I started using raw honey. And I was good. I was living it up with my raw honey. People like to tell me that I'm doing stuff wrong or that's bad for me. And it's so annoying. Sorry guys. Like I know some people really are doing it from the bottom of their heart. But it's all about how you say it because, girl, I started using raw honey and then everybody was like, you shouldn't use honey because you have to use too much. You need to go and start using agave nectar because you use less. It's better for you. There's so many health benefits, blah, 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 blah. So I got some agave nectar or whatever the heck they called it and now people want to come for me in my snapchat dms 
and talking about you shouldn't use agave nectar it's bad for you all the studies that said it was better is wrong and blah 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 you need to use raw honey and i'm like look what like what <laughs> sorry y'all i'm pissed but why is a study now coming out saying that it's just not true when all this time people wanted to convince me to use it and now people want to convince me not to use it like just shut up sorry guys i think anything is better compared to sugar like sugar has no purpose no health benefits so i mean like just let me decide when i want to use agave nectar and when i want to use honey i like my drinks to be cold in my opinion Agave nectar dissolves better in cold drinks. It does. It literally dissolves in cold drinks. Now with honey, I don't feel like it dissolves. I feel like honey is better for like hot drinks and your tea and stuff. So, I don't know. If you want to use honey, use honey. You can also use pure maple syrup. Um, so yeah, you can use you can use maple syrup, you can use honey, or you can use agave nectar. It's up to you. I'm going to use agave nectar, okay? But I do use honey too. And this is why I like to use it in this um, container is because I can now shake it up instead of just stirring it up because I used to just drink it in a cup. of the vlog y'all i hope you guys try this drink um a lot of people on snapchat asked me like what do i think about it i literally have felt and seen results so fast i have not even been doing i mean i think i've been drinking this for at least like a month now but i also did a cleanse where i just ate clean with these drinks for five days and then after that I've just been eating healthy, but pretty much eating clean. And I'll get into that in the next vlog because I don't want to spend too much time on here. Somebody go put Finn inside. Cause dad must not know he's out. Finn get inside. Go to bed. So we were supposed to be bike riding. But unfortunately, one of my tires was popped, so we had to do something else. This, these are the times I want to truck. I've done so many styles on Skylar's braids, and then I catch her doing this every time. The girls wanted to ride their bikes, but Taylor's bike had a flat tire, so Devin's trying to fix it.
said it's a hole. It's a hole. It gotta be a hole somewhere in it because it ain't holding on there. It's and it comes straight back out. Mm -hmm. Oh, I used to hate that about bikes. So that means we gotta like take the inner tube part out and everything. We have bad news. So your um tire has a hole in it. So when daddy puts the air in there it comes straight back out turn the music down off look at my face y'all i was so bummed out but hot scotch and bubbles will fix that i can't see Hopscotch, blow bubbles, and also, oh, I need a visor. That would be so cute. Um, hopscotch, bubbles. I was filming my mom. Don't tell her. Scotch, but we did not know the rules so we had to look up the rules and we still have fun we were doing it right kind of but we didn't have all the rules Good job. Go ahead. Why is Daddy not putting that one leg down? Why you can't put one foot down?
stuck on the post. Poor thing. Oh, yeah, Finn got a haircut, you guys. You got, some of you guys should have seen it on um, Snapchat. Oh, yeah. All right, keep going around. Come here, Finn. There you go. All right, maybe we should just take it off of him. No, if you take it off right now and then unravel it and then put them back away. enough water not boiling over yeah. put it back up to high go on the balcony and eat stay tuned for the Again, if you guys follow us on Snapchat, yes, you need to follow us right now. Just look up my name or ETC Blog Mag. But yo, we love crabs. I don't care. We you uh, we eat blue crabs, snow crab legs, shrimp, all of it. I just love seafood. I literally wish I could eat it every day. And usually when we have seafood, we'll have just like corn on the cob and broccoli or maybe a salad. Um, what other greens do we have? Oh, and green beans sometimes, but we decided on broccoli today because Devin loves broccoli. Um, so yeah, I mean, I figure since we haven't vlogged in a while and you guys know this is how we get down, I figured this would be a good first vlog back. Um, and our fruit of the day is strawberries. I also think the warm weather really inspired us um, for dinner and to vlog because the weather was amazing. I think it was like in the high 70s. It was so nice. push you I don't care and that applies to everything um, today I, I posted that talking about school students like pushing school students to to go further and do more but you can think about your own circle if you got people around you that don't push you to to be better or or try to you know they want to stay stagnant in, in what they doing and they're you know they don't they just don't inspire you to do anything else but what you're doing they just want you to stay in the same spot pretty much like running on the treadmill stay away from those type of people slowly remove those people from your circle and uh 
as always, as always, be great. Be great. All right? It's my food for thought. We in MD, so definitely about to get in these crabs. Taylor just stole my corn, but I'm not tripping. I'm not tripping. <laughs> she just stole my corn. Well? I'm not tripping. Yeah, you stole my corn. Like, right while I was doing my food for thought, she stole my food. You see the irony but in that? I already did it. I know, you got it now. You got it. <laughs> Later that evening, Devin got a craving for a milkshake. He loves milkshakes. So we decided to go to Colston, one of our favorite, favorite ice cream stores, our creamery. And yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, we're done. Hi, Curly. Hi, Curly. 